Day two of the Cheltenham Festival kicks off with the champion bumper. Just the eight races today. Here at Cheltenham. Oh, we start off with this two more National Hunt flat race. It is a, a Group 1, not a Class 7, as it suggests on that screen there. So big star is at the top for Derek Hinton, losing their will. Joshua Sutherland, Mohaya Malyoon for Matt Cooper. Dramatised Paul Rhodes, Groovy Baby for Derek Hinton and Quadrant for Paul Rhodes. So six of them in this Grade 1 bumper. And they're away and racing. And Mohaya Malyoon is the first one to show. I've got a small feel for this. In order to get one or two more in this, it's a big prize for the Grade 1 person. It's going to be a nice, of course, to run at it. But it's, uh, usually the big guns have got a few in as well. I'm surprised to see that Graham Clutterbuck's not got one in. He normally likes a runner or two in this. And so too does Leon van Rensburg. It's Mohaya Malyun in the lead for Matt Cooper. Quadrant in second. Paul Rhodes, who also likes to stick a runner in this one. He's got two, he's got dramatised as well. And uh, between them, losing their will for Joshua Sutherland. And then Derek Hinton's pair, Big Star and, Gra and Gravy Baby. So, mile and a half to go. And Mohaya Malyun is well clear. Trying to give Matt Cooper a festival winner. See if I can remember the score from yesterday. I know that Josh has got three. There's a few people on two. And a few more on one. Right, Mohaya Malyun is the leader. Losing the will second. And Big Star, Dramatised, Quadrant and Gravy Baby. In fact, I'm pretty sure that nobody else in this field has got any winners so far. The festival apart from Josh, so... He could be extending his lead. Or somebody else could be joining the leaderboard. Mahaya Malyun, who leads it for Matt Cooper. And the rest of them are virtually in the line. They're just losing their will ahead. Mahaya Malyun is coming back to them a little bit now. Only three, three lengths clear. And we're losing their will second. Quadrant now is just about third. With dramatised Big Star and Gravy Baby together. Racing downhill. And they're swinging left handed. It's Mahaya Malyun. About to be joined though by losing the will. Uh, losing the will. Looks like he was going to swoop by then, but it's just taking a bit of a hold on him. Not going to go too soon. There's still four and a half furlongs to go. And a bit soon to be hitting the front. Although Dramatised looks like he might be interested in doing that as well. This is looking like it could be run up into a bit of a tussle between Dramatised and losing the will. Although, having said that, here come Gravy Baby and Quadrant round the outside. And Big Star is not to be left out either. So suddenly it's wide open again with three furlongs to go. And Mohaya Malyun has kicked on and he's saying, you're going to get past me. You're going to have to work hard to do so. And they are doing it as well because Quadrant and Gravy Baby have now just about managed to get past him, losing the win and Dramatise didn't pick up like it looked like they were going to there's a furlong and a half to go and Quadrant is about a head in front of Gravy Baby in second, Dramatise is now finally starting to get going, losing the will is making hard work of it and it's Quadrant in the lead, Gravy Baby is trying to close and Quadrant is in front but Gravy Baby hits the front and Gravy Baby is going to come back trail here because Gravy Baby who was killed in the first race of the season has come back to life and won the bumper, well there you go, that just about says everything you need to know about what I think about the bumper. It's just been won by a dead, resurrected horse. Gravy Baby takes it. Well done, Del Boy. And Derek Hinson gets his on the leaderboard. Gravy Baby for Derek Hinson. Killed jumping fences the first week of the season, so he brought it back as a flat horse. Brilliant. Quadrant second for Paul Rhodes. Dramatised for Paul Rhodes was third. Losing the wheel, Joshua Sutherland for <laughs> Big Star for Derek Hinson again was fifth.